How are we doing out there? Boy, do we have a treat for you. What better way to wrap up this great day of uh, clinics on the Ernie Ball stage than with the legend, Honey Boy Edwards. <laughs> Honey Boy is uh, originally from Shaw, Mississippi, about 150 miles southeast of Memphis, but he has called the south side of Chicago home since 1956. And he has played with everybody who matters in the world of blues. And Honey Boy, we have a surprise for you before we get started today. On Monday, the 28th of June, Honey Boy is going to turn 95 years old. We've got a birthday cake for Honey Boy, and we want this crowd to sing happy birthday to Honey Boy. Accompanying Honey Boy today on the harp, great harpist Michael Frank. And Michael's going to say a few words about uh, what it means to, to be here at Crossroads and some thoughts and feelings that he and Honey Boy have for the, for the cause that this is all about, the Crossroads Center. So, Michael? Honey Boy and I are very happy to be here together. Uh, we've been knowing each other 38 years. And uh, I wanted to say something because both Honey, Honey Boy and I have had people in our families that uh, died from drug abuse and alcohol abuse. And uh, so we appreciate what Eric Clapton and all these you folks are doing, coming out here supporting drug treatment. You probably know somebody. If you're a musician, one of the hardest things is to say no to the alcohol that's free backstage or at the bar. <laughs> One of the hardest things about helping a friend is having the conversation that they need help. Very painful to have that for both of you. But somebody's, it's a dirty job, somebody's got to do it. So show people that you love them by helping them find help. They've got to accept the help, but you can help them to get to the help. So just keep that in mind. And if you need help yourself, it's available through Crossroads and lots of other programs. And if you see us on tour and you need help or know somebody needs help, I'm also a social worker, so you can come up and ask me. Yeah. All right? The Crossroads Center, in addition Crossroads. to being uh, on the Caribbean island of Antigua, also uh, has a facility in South Florida. So uh, for those uh, family members or friends of yours who might uh, need the help of that uh, organization, uh, Florida's an option for them as well. We're working on... When we met each other, we both were pretty much in tune from the beginning of our set. I was 23 and he's 57. Well, figure it out, our hearing has changed and now we don't agree about who's in tune when. So if you see us having an argument up here, you wonder what's going on. It, it might be about whether we're in tune or whatever, but... When you're playing the blues, you work through those things. And keep on playing. More, uh, more bass. More bass.
Yes, I'm going. Yes, I'm going. In your crying world, make me stay. Boy, you cry, die, die. So day being four hours of ball, four child coming. I'm now Thank you. 
back up now. Be down to the ground. Be right now. Yeah. 
You guys want one more number? How about this man, 95 years old on Monday. Unbelievable. Folks, we are all over the world. We move around a lot. So come and see us somewhere else, wherever you're from. Look us up on the web at davidhoneyboyedwards.com. Uh, and come and see us somewhere else. Might be in Canada, might be in Pennsylvania. We're all over. Isn't the blues a great thing? It's a worldwide community. You go to an event like this, you meet somebody you never knew before, and all of a sudden you're friends because of the blues because of folks like Honey Boy. Thank you very much. And how about a prayer clapping and a crossroads treatment program? Thank you. Thanks again.